I've been in it for, but probably know just what to do. The history of artists throughout the centuries has been that they have taken a position in which they speak That's from right. the they gods. They have an obligation they to sway the American public because of their, their position. Artists throughout time have taken a political stance. I don't know where you've been. And I You know, when you wake up in the morning and you read the newspaper and you watch the news and you talk to your friends and you talk on the internet and you check out your computer and you find out what's really going on, it's incredibly sad. And I do feel a very, very definite tipping point. I think this hammer is going to fall. Back in the days of shopping on. with Islamic fascists. I think about the war every day and trying to do everything I can to stop it because more soldiers are going to have to go back and go through what I went through. We're in a different war now. So uh, we've got an enemy who basically will convert or kill us. I don't know how anybody could say that it's OK what we're doing because it's just not. This time, yeah, I'm definitely watching my own ass a little bit more just because I want my kid to have a dad. Thanks for jamming with me. Yeah, Jesus. Right. You do hugs for old Vietnam. Yeah, yeah you yeah. do. <laughs> In this show, our responsibility to the audience is no longer to make the audience feel fuzzy, warm feelings at the end of the show. The responsibility of this show is to make the audience feel, period. I think you'll have some very negative reaction to the political message tonight. You'll have a lot of people thoroughly embrace it. But let's remember that freedom of speech does not mean freedom from consequences. singing to the choir. Me personally, I'd like the choir to get off their ass and do something.